Welcome to a brand new video. Today's video is going to be very short. It's going to be about muscle groups that women are attracted to and love. The facial muscles. Women are most attracted to men whose faces inspire their productive to nurture proclivity to nurture with their desire to mate with sexuality mature partner. Now what does this mean? They like men with large eyes, medium to small nose, baby face features, and a strong jaw and wide cheek or cheekbones. Women want a compassionate looking good guy, a bad boy that exudes sexual power. Basically, women have made up their mind to not make up their mind. Here's what the muscles look like on the face. Next on the list is forearms. The forearms have all these different muscles right here. And they make your veins and arteries pop out when they're well strengthened and you work them out. For some reason, they're really attracted to this. And number five on the list is shoulders. All three shoulder heads. Wider, lift weights, work them sideways, lateral raises. A woman is sexually satisfaction is strongly linked to her partner's attractiveness in shoulder, believe it or not. Broad and well-defined shoulders have always been considered a sign of strength and masculinity. So I guess looks really do matter. And screw personality, right? And I also guess size really matters too when it comes to the arms and the shoulders. If you could only train one muscle, which one would it be? Let me know in the comments below. The next muscle on the list is biceps. It's a symbol of strength. Women feel it's a sign that you take good care of your body and admitted that they love to see a hint of a man's bicep through the t-shirt or sweater. Strong arms signify a man's ability to protect women and inadvertently his ability to lift her up. The next muscle group should be no surprise to anyone. It's the abs. Training the abdominal muscles when they pop out, there's just something about it that people like. Women rated the abs as the sexiest muscle on a man's body. And it makes sense, your abdominals are front and center. Well, if you're not wearing clothes, so her eyes are inevitably drawn there at your first glance. Other than your face, of course. Lucky for you, you, you can scope your abs. No such luck with changing your face though. To be fair, it's not that women are completely shallow. Men with a large amount of abdominal fat have lower levels of T, testosterone, which translates to a lower sex drive and fertility. Number two on the list is the glutes. And here's all the different glutes that you can work out. And you can do squats, deadlifts, lunges, and this will help grow them. And for those of you that are new to my channel, I made a video about a website that can show you all the different exercises that you can do to grow whatever muscle you want. So if you haven't seen that video, I'll leave it at the end of this video and in the comments below so you can go check it out. And you can get to learn all these different muscle groups and learn how to work them out. And you can do it at home with no weights, with weights, whatever it is. The website can show you how to do it. Now pause the video and let me know in the comments below if you know what number one is without going fast forwarding in this video and finding out or cheating or looking it up in Google. Can anyone guess what the number one muscle group is that they are attracted to? I'm curious. Let me know in the comments below. So if you guessed the lateral abdominal muscles, you were correct. The lateral abdominal muscles contained all these three different muscles. Now that you know what they're attracted to, Make sure you hit the gym and start working on these muscle groups. And if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button for amazing videos on how to make money, investing, just informative information like this, and things I do research on, I constantly share with you guys. And if you'd like me to make a video about a certain topic or something you want to learn about, just let me know. I'll create the content for you. I'll do some research and put it together. So just let me know in the comments below what do you want to see a video for.